This year, the Country Club of Darien hosted the Met Golf Association's Ike Schroepley Championship, one of the most prestigious amateur golf tournaments in the Northeast region. A total of 125 competitors teed off on day one and 44 made the cut for day two, three of which were local competitors. The 65th annual Ike Schroepley Championship. The first local competitor we looked at was Rowayton resident Brad Jordan. Jordan, a two-time club champion at the Country Club of Darien, showed very strong on his first day in the competition, shooting a 74 and completing his overall goal of making the cut. Though not finishing up top on the second day, he still performed well, shooting cleanly from the fairways and showing strong on the greens. Next, we took a look at Darien resident and recent Brunswick graduate, Ben Carpenter. Carpenter, who's going to play golf at Yale next year, and who also has won the Junior Club Championship at the Country Club of Darien in the past, had a great showing in his first two rounds. Shooting 67 and 72, he showed little struggles in his first two rounds of play. The next golfer we looked at was lifelong Darien resident, Bob Stelbin, who is also a member at the Country Club of Darien. He's won an astonishing 12 club championships at the Country Club of Darien and had a magnificent first round, shooting 70. Just like Brad Jordan, he completed his goal of making the cut and played well on his second day. His best strength as a golfer is definitely his consistency. It is what has led him to win 12 club championships. He will possibly go down as the greatest golfer to play at the Country Club of Darien. We went over to look at Ethan Ng, a golfer at Stanford University who had played almost perfectly throughout the entire tournament and was in first place by one shot going into the 18th hole. After his first shot, he was just short of the river and launched his second shot onto the green. Unfortunately, he three-putted, but it still resulted in a par, keeping him up in the lead by one. We caught back up with Ben Carpenter on the par 5 18th hole, where he needed an eagle to tie the leader. After his drive, he found himself on the edge of the fairway, but unfortunately landed under a tree after his second shot. He made a great play to get onto the green and had an excellent putt to birdie. He finished his final round with a 69 and finished the tournament in third place. An excellent performance for the future Yale golfer. <laughs> After Ng, we took a look at Mark Costanza, who was one shot off the lead going into the 18th hole. He needed a birdie to tie it up. He found himself in good positioning after his first shot and was just off the green after his second and had a chance to chip in for the win. Let's listen in. At the end of the two-day, three-round tournament, Mark Costanza was crowned champion of the Ike after an incredible chip-in finish to win it. With special thanks to the Met Golf Association and the Country Club of Darien, on behalf of the DAF Media crew, we'd like to thank you for watching.